Brianne Schoenwerth, get your fixed physical therapy and performance. Now, you may not realize it, but there is one specific thing that may be contributing to all of your running injuries. And that one thing is single leg control, meaning how your body is able to balance, stabilize, and control itself when you're standing on a single leg. If you didn't know, when you run, you are either on a single leg or no legs. There's no point in time with running that you're on both legs. And surprisingly, when I work with runners and I look at single leg control, many times they don't have very good control. So just standing on, and you can test this out for yourself right now, stand on one leg and just see how long you can balance there and see how that control is, see how difficult it is for you. If you struggle standing on a single leg on solid ground in a very controlled environment, your body has no clue how to control itself when you are running, landing on a like dynamic surface, if, especially if you're on the trail, with increased forces, all this stuff going on. That if you can't control yourself just here, you're never gonna control yourself when you're running. And if you do control yourself, which obviously you do, you're not falling all the time, but there's a lot of things that have to work really, really hard in order to be able to control yourself. Eventually, those things working really, really hard create injuries, or at least create pain in order to tell you, hey, look at me, I need help. Um, so I really encourage you, like, do a test for yourself. See how your single leg control is. If it's awful, start working on it. Um, even if it's not awful, start working on it. There's a lot of ways to challenge it as far as doing some, like, single leg squats, doing some quick jumps on a single leg, turning your head, doing all these things to challenge it just a little bit more because when we're running, we are going up and down curbs, we're on trails, we're doing hills, we're ro like over rocks, roots, all this stuff that we do need to be on a single leg and be able to adapt to things that are going on. So if you have not checked that out before and you are injuring yourself a lot or finding yourself injured a lot, I highly encourage you to one, test that out, and then two, start working on it if it's a problem for you. Um, if you have any other questions for me, um, you can find a way to contact me on my website, getyourfixpt.com. You can also find about other, a lot of other information on there as well.